all right hello this is Daryl aka Maine Catholic guy uh, just out in my uh, out in my uh, patio out back just finished doing a little bit of yard work not too much I got the fire going let's see if uh, yeah, you can probably make it out a little bit a little bit of a fire going uh, Basically, uh, since last fall, my weed whacker has been out of string, so I restringed that today and did a little bit of weed whacking. Got that taken care of, making the house look good for uh, when we get ready to sell. Uh, I'm just out here in my white t-shirt. I usually don't wear white t-shirts when I'm out doing yard work, but uh, I got back from church today and... Uh, you know, put the old sweats and kept the white t-shirt. Of course, got rid of my dress shirt, uh, put that in the laundry. But uh, just got in the white t-shirt and uh, hopefully didn't get too dirty. A little grass stain, but it'll come off in the wash. Uh, I'm not too worried about it. Uh, that's about it. It's still been kind of cool. Uh, it's actually supposed to rain today. And uh, luckily, uh, it's bright. Sunny, got a cloud in the sky right now, so uh, I'm happy. A little cool, it's in the low 60s, but uh, that's about normal for this time of year. Uh, anytime the sun is shining, it's good, uh, especially here. Uh, we've been in the clouds for a long time, been raining almost every day. Uh, just got maybe a couple days in, I just got my uh, front porch. Uh, the railings and uh, around the outside, I got that uh, stain with Thompson's water seal. I got to do the, uh, the actual deck, the uh, front, and I got to do this deck here. This deck won't take long, just a, a roller, probably within 10-15 minutes I'll have this done with a roller because uh, there's no railings or anything. Out front I got a railing on it, so that was kind of a pain, but it uh, came out pretty good. Uh, just got to find uh, what I need. I got a ramp, my mother's handicap ramp on it. I got to get the screwdriver and unscrew that. That shouldn't be too hard. Uh, I did a little bit, uh, get the leaves off the deck and everything. Uh, again, that's no problem. Uh, so yeah, just uh, doing a little bit at a time. I brought a load of junk up to the dump uh, yeah, yesterday, and, uh, so slowly but surely I cleaned out, uh, the closet and what was my chapel, uh, I don't have a chapel anymore until we move, hopefully, uh, when we get a place, uh, I'll be able to put the chapel back up, I took all the wood and stuff from taking that with me, so, uh, a little bit of a change, uh, the, uh, place uh, that we wanted to move to in Riverview, uh, they're not building the uh, floor plans that we wanted anymore. Uh, there is another place in uh, Sun City Center, try saying that five times fast. Uh, basically it's a retirement community, but uh, this particular place is not a retirement community. It's, uh, they got kids, they got playgrounds and stuff. So they are building that same uh, floor plan that I wanted. Uh, so putting up the house, as I mentioned before, like something around the second week of June, hoping for a quick sell, uh, looking to get out of here end of July, first part of August, and I was talking to the realtor down there, and uh, he says you'll have uh, have a house available with that floor plan uh, around the time that I hope to be moving, so keep your thumbs up, fingers crossed, prayers and everything, uh, I could use them, because uh, that would be awesome to be able to just, uh, you know, not have to worry about staying in a hotel or sh sh uh, extended stay somewhere uh, just get get down there and move into a house would be nice uh, so yeah we're uh, looking forward to that uh, uh, obviously still got a lot of cleaning left uh, 
Uh, like I said, made one dump run. I'll probably make another one sometime this week. Uh, basically getting rid of small stuff right now. I just got a bunch of boxes in so I can start boxing things up. Uh, especially stuff that we don't use much. Uh, start going through that. and like Especially like pots and pans. You know, we got the pots and pans that we use all the time. And I just bought a brand new uh, stainless steel set of pots and pans. So some of the old ones that I had were going to be tossing or well, whatever. So yeah just uh went through my closet got to go through it again maybe some more clothes to get rid of uh but uh things coming together and uh can't wait uh, it's gonna be an adventure and uh i'm thinking uh depending on what my finances are when i get down there uh first i was thinking about a motorcycle but uh the traffic down there uh, might not be a good idea, but uh, I was looking at maybe getting a sea do and uh, what I want is about around seven to ten grand. If I can uh, swing it, that would be nice because uh, it's just a personal watercraft. I'm sure you all know what they are, but uh, you know, you can buzz around the bay. I know. People, uh, I've seen YouTube videos where people actually went from Florida to uh, the Bahamas or whatever on them things. I don't know if I'd go, uh, venture that far, but uh, I don't know what they do for gas because I don't imagine they hold that much gas. Or they must have put some extra gas in storage or something, but uh, it'd be fun to zip around the bay and uh, stuff with, so that would be fun. So I'm thinking about that. Uh, my uh, first priority is I want to get a new car. Not that there's anything wrong with mine. Uh, I mean, it's a 2013 Toyota RAV4. It's only got about 55,000 miles on it. So, I mean, it's got a lot, of, a lot of years left, a lot of miles left on it. But, uh, you know, starting off with a new car that I don't have to worry about for quite a while. Uh, probably looking at the same kind of car like a RAV4. I, I like that. It's been good to me. I haven't had any major problems with it. Uh, knock on wood. I have woods at yeah, the deck there. Uh, but yeah, uh, my stick shift, I just had to have a battery replaced in it. Uh, I'll be getting rid of that. Uh, uh, I don't... I know how to drive it now and everything, so... I don't use it that much. I, uh, I still buzz around with it here and there, but uh, you know I'm not going to take it with me. I'm going to just uh, after I pay it off with the money from the house sale, I'm going to just sell it or uh, probably sell it to either a dealership or I don't know if anybody wants it, but uh, yeah. Uh, so yeah, things are uh, going good. Uh, Sun City Center, uh, as far as for people who don't know, uh, it's about halfway between Tampa and uh, Sarasota, and uh, both have good beaches. Uh, Clearwater Beach is, you know, not too far from Tampa. Uh, both Sarasota and Tampa have Latin masses. So, uh, I've been to the one in Tampa, I like that church, it's probably where I'll end up going. Uh, Tampa's probably about five minutes closer, depending on traffic, to uh, where I'll be if that's where I end up going. So, plus, uh, from the one mass that I've been to, I like the people. Uh, they're outgoing, friendly, and, uh, you know, welcome me and everything, so, you know, I got that going for me, and, uh, so, yeah, just, uh, getting stuff together for the move, uh, probably being taking pictures, I think, the 9th or 10th, something like that, uh, anyway, it's in June, 9th or 10th, and, uh, the pod is coming uh, the 12th, and then uh, the real fun begins, because then I can start 
packing stuff in the pods and uh, it'll be good uh, hopefully get a quick sale uh, and it'll really be uh, game on uh, from what our real estate agent told us there's a uh, very low inventory right now for houses on the market and uh, they got a bunch of buyers and uh, so hopefully yeah good lord willing i got a saint joseph statue so uh when a house goes up i'm gonna uh bury the old saint joseph statue upside down and uh, say some prayers and uh see what happens and uh appreciate your prayers and uh just wanted to give a quick uh video here uh hope you all having a good day whatever you're doing on this uh sunny sunday now uh, it was a little cloudy this morning, uh, looked like rain this morning, but uh, after I got out of mass, sun came out and bright blue skies now. And, uh, yeah, this, I'll take it. Like I said, uh, I guess it's going to be uh, warm tomorrow in the 70s maybe. Uh, maybe some scattered thunderstorms, maybe some big ones, uh, who knows. But uh yeah, this is a good day, and uh, I'll uh, catch you all later, and uh, this is Daryl, and uh, you know who I am. Hit the like, subscribe button for the maybe five or six people that see this video. <laughs> uh, hopefully, I'll start getting some new viewers, but uh, anyway, I wanted to keep this kind of quick, because... Uh, I know sometimes those 30, 40 minute videos are tough to watch, and uh, I know I don't watch many of them. So uh, I'll end this now, and uh, I'll be back on uh, hopefully sometime soon, get another uh, update on what's going on. Uh, thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye.